Hey yo, my Planet Coaster friends, Johnny Five Live here, and welcome back to another episode of Coaster Spotlight. And in today's video, we're gonna be looking at Tundra Bobsled Coaster created by Mr. Vanderpants. So stay tuned and let's check it out. Alrighty, this was sent in by one of our Discord expert builders, and here he says, Hey, I heard bobsled I heard bobsled coasters were in demand. So I decided to submit the one I made a while back. It took me a while, but I managed to get all green stats on this one. Hope you'll enjoy it. Boom. Quick and simple. To the point, another bobsled coaster. I think this might be the fifth one we're featuring so far. Anyways, let's get right on into it. All right, everybody, here we are at Tundra. This is a beautiful looking blueprint. Love the little glass buildings here you got going on. Uh, the stairway to nowhere, though, that seems a little strange. No way in there. Just a random staircase. So something seems to be missing there, but that's quite all right. Another one over here. How do you get into these mysterious buildings, I wonder? <laughs> Quite nice looking, though. I love the style here of the uh, the glasswork on the alpine buildings. And this jutting around like that, very nice. A little rounded gazebo top held up by a chain. It's a very fancy looking. Like the, uh, the A on the tundra, looking like a mountain. Although it kind of reads like an M, doesn't it? Still very cool. Very unique style going on here. It looks lovely. So let's uh, jump right on into it. Another bobsled. I'm excited for this. So here's a look at the stats, everyone, and I'll cut to it as soon as one is here. Right, let's take a look at it at nighttime. Wowee. Icy blue. That looks sharp. It's subtle, but it's soft. It's softly lit, but we have these hits of orange where it needs to be. I love the way this station lights up. It's a really unique build. I love this. It's very original. Good job on this, uh, Mr. Vanderpants. So we got we're gonna try this out at nighttime here in a different perspective. I think, um, actually we'll just do the same, same one, but at the back. See how that goes.
All right, everyone. I think this is a very fun bobsled. It just whips and swishes around those turns there. Uh, very exhilarating through and through. Love the colors, and I really, again, love the art style. I'm not sure what the staircase to nowhere is about, though. Uh, but this is a very unique boarding station and build. The only thing I would do for feedback for you is watch your queue. It got a little sloppy, as you can see, and you guys probably saw that in the setup. And it's because at one point, like, it starts off fine. It's using angle snap. But then you start curving it, and then that's when things start having a hard time fitting. And then it just gets a little sloppier. The moment you break away from angle snap, you basically have to commit to that and have, like, a very organic cue. The moment you go back to it trying to snap around corners and stuff, it's no longer going to work anymore because you're so off-grid already. So, not, not the biggest feedback though, not the biggest gripe, it still worked, it still got the job done. But it would have been nice to see that a little bit cleaner. And then we got some shops down in here too, and then you can put some tables and stuff in there, I like it. Very nice blueprint, solid bobsled overall. Great job on this one, Mr. Vanderpants, and that's going to do it for this episode of Coaster Spotlight, everybody. If you enjoyed, please be sure to smash that like button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe for more daily Planet Coaster videos. If you'd like to support the show, you could do so by becoming a patron. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.